We're going to show you how to prepare pur using the gong fu method. Gong fu is a Chinese word meaning the art or mastery of doing something. This is gong fu cha. Feel free to deviate as much as you may like off of the steps that follow. When you first get into your pur cake, start from the top and gently release the leaves, prying apart leaf by leaf. Remember to try to keep each leaf fully intact as this will give you the best flavor. Separate about 3 to 5 grams depending on how strong you want your tea and how many people you're drinking tea with. Once you have your tea ready, then you'll want to warm up the vessels that you're going to be using. This allows better heat retention when making your tea. The quality of the water is very, very important as most of tea is water. A spring water will be best, but you'll find what works best for you as well. Using a glass pitcher like this allows you to serve tea to others much easier, and it makes sure each cup is the same. Feel free to use whatever you want when you prepare tea. In this video, we're using a Gai Wan to prepare the tea, as it's a great way to see the leaves open up, also extremely easy to use, and it allows you to smell the tea very easily. The first thing to do is to wash the leaves and also to awaken them. You do this with hot water. And any time you prepare pour, you want to use about 180 degrees. You'll see what you like best, but this is a great place to start, is 180. You only need the water with the leaves for a few seconds and then dump out the water. Let the tea sit for a moment and then start again. With a high quality pour like this, you should be able to get about 20 pots of tea. Each subsequent steeping will be a higher temperature and longer steeping time. Now you want to go ahead and warm up your pouring vessel or pitcher. This will allow the heat to be retained much more when you pour your tea into it to serve tea to others. You want to let the tea sit or brew for about 10 seconds. This will be plenty of time with a high quality tea like this. If you want the tea stronger, simply add more leaves in the beginning as opposed to relying on steeping time to make a stronger tea. The longer you steep the tea, the more bitter the tea will be. So again, just add more leaves if you want the tea stronger. Now is a good time to empty the cups of the hot water. Be careful, they will be very hot. And your tea should be ready by now. Go ahead and pour the tea either straight into the cups or into the pitcher. You're welcome to use a strainer here to pick up any loose debris. But if you give it just a second or two, the loose debris will fall to the bottom of the cup anyway. Make sure to get all of the tea out. Make sure you shake out every drop. Otherwise, it will become bitter by sitting for too long. Also, it's best to take the lid off of your Gai Wan or pot so that the leaves don't continue to cook. And there we have it. We prepared a cup of poor tea in this simple, traditional way. Feel free to deviate from the steps in any way that you please. This is simply just a good place to start and a great place to continue. Enjoy.